All right, JJ, your turn to tee off here. Uh, have at it. What did you think of today's press conference with both Cashman and Boone? All right, for starters, it was an hour of a waste of time. It was an absolute <laughs> an waste half. of my time. I mean, how many times do I need to hear the recycled bits about we're close, we're close, we're close? Uh, I guess the Yankees turned into bronze medalists, to use yes, your terminology. The bombers, it seemed like, like the it. Yankees yeah. are very content and very satisfied <laughs> with winning 94, 95 games going to the American League Championship Series and not bringing home the ultimate prize. Can somebody ask the manager, number one, about the Garrett Cole decision in Game 3? was asked about it yesterday. I didn't hear about that today. Nobody asked about 2004. And again, how many times do I need to hear the general manager and the manager say that they're close? And then they're going to insult the fan base by saying that IKF is a great defensive shortstop? Hold on a second now. Did they watch the same games that we watched? Did they go and sit IKF in the biggest games of the year? Game 5 against Cleveland game one against the Astros they don't have the confidence to start him but then they're going to lecture me you and all of us about the idea that they are close and that the idea that he's a great defensive please waste of time they are not close they're further away I can't believe you want me to follow yeah. that up. <laughs> yeah. like I, can't, I, brought I, know, you, I brought you these snacks. You're trying to cheer I me knew, up? I appreciate I that. I knew that you would need that. I, I do. Thank you. That. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. I appreciate it. Here that. are my takeaways. Maybe not quite as passionate as JJ's, but my takeaways, number one, is they wouldn't let Brian Cashman hold that press conference if he wasn't going to be in charge moving forward. No way would they let him speak on behalf of the entire team. So that was number one. My problem, though, is he has been there since 1998, right, doing that job. I felt like he didn't reflect that this season in anything he did offseason trade deadline Aaron Judge and then also when Aaron Boone spoke about IKF and he said he was what we expected well that's not good enough I I'm so with you like that's not good enough it's what you expected you barely beat the Guardians in the division series like right. that's not good enough why is why this season it just feels like it's always been oh it's okay we're gonna be okay we'll be fine any that's excuses were embarrassing right. too. how yeah. many times do I have to hear about Ben and whoever being hurt enough well, you're the uh, Yankees yeah, that, that, I mean that is fair though I mean it's fair but Brantley was out for the Astros no, I know but Phillies have uh, issues they counted on LeMayu and Ben and to be the guys who put the ball in play at least and have he wouldn't have 30 strikeouts outs in two games but well, who put the I, team but, together but I know I, mean, I get what you're saying I mean <laughs> listen they I think the problem the biggest problem is they are close relatively speaking in the rest of the rest of baseball but they're farther away from the Astros than they've been I think what people need to see Yankee fans need to see is a little bit of this kind of passion right. you hear from JJ from Cashman and Boone they want to see that frustration Boone referenced it but it's really not you're not seeing it you're not hearing it Cashman's just eh, you know put, we're putting the team together look I know Cashman feels strongly about a lot of these these things but he also gets too close to these guys he brings in he defended uh, Gary Sanchez for years wrongly and he gets tied up in these defenses of his and they, he ends up making poor decisions now they're going to be tied to Donaldson and IKF they have to make better decisions that's the biggest the, problem. the worst thing to me is that they truly believe that they are doing everything the right way and the reasons why they haven't broken through not to win to get to a World Series is because of bad luck and injuries that's essentially what they're saying Boone, oh, I want to hoist the trophy. Obviously, you want to hoist the trophy. How about you do something about it? And Cashman, the same thing. They believe, well, we put this team together. It should have won on paper. Look at all the numbers. Look what the computer says. And it didn't in reality, and that's a big problem. And now they have even a bigger problem because, as you'd expect, Aaron Judge was a big topic today as well. And it wasn't exactly reassuring listening to Brian Cashman basically say that, hey, ask how. That's not my call. If they can't come to terms here, Harp, what could their plan be without Aaron Judge? Their plan Plan BB without Aaron Listen, Judge. There is no reasonable plan B. That's why it, it's it's just I know it's a word we throw around, but it'd be unacceptable for them not to re-sign Judge. Hal Steinbrenner can't even show his face in New York as it is. He got booed with the Jeter thing this year. If he doesn't start, uh, bring Judge back, he's persona non grata in New York. And there is no real plan B. Look, there's not a lot of power in the free agent market, which is a problem for the Mets as well. You could go out and you could sign. I mean, Brandon Nimmo is kind of like the second best outfielder out there in, in the free agent market. You could sign. Trey Turner, which would probably be the best move, and try to rearrange some pieces in there. He would give you a better all-around offense. It would, you wouldn't have nearly as much power. But there is no there is no real plan B that would be acceptable for the end. I would have liked to see, though, Cashman, instead of just saying either no comment or that's Hal's issue, I would like to ask him, yeah, but baseball-wise, do you have a number that you believe would be the right way to go with Judge? Whatever it is, eight years, 320, whatever it may be. And they didn't answer that.